Hey dads, are you looking for a good vacuum cleaner for your car? One of those little small handheld ones? I got one sent to me. This company sent it to me, so I figured that I would do a little unboxing with you guys. Uh, I did accidentally already open this box because we thought it was something else, although I didn't open it totally. I just kind of looked up and peeked in, so it's going to be kind of a first look for me too, even though I, I can peek in. Uh, first of all, if you're new here, and uh, this is Dad Reviews. Uh, where I give you my unedited, hopefully more authentic look at the products that I like, use, and have, so, and get sent to me in the mail and unbox. So if you're interested in that, you might want to consider clicking that subscribe button. Also, that thumbs up button is very much appreciated. And if you do decide to subscribe, make sure to hit the bell. That way you actually get notified of our videos. So, um, like I said, the company sent me this, and I know it's a vacuum cleaner, so it's one of those little uh, handheld ones. So we're going to do a little checking out. If you guys want to check this out, I'll link it up down in the description below. They have some uh, reviews on there. It might be good to go and get some of their reviews, read those reviews, and see what they're saying there. That's just tracking. Okay. So this is it, a car vacuum cleaner. Multifunctional car vacuum cleaner. Okay. It's a 12 volt. Dry and wet. Okay, that's cool. That's great. In case your kid spills anything. Oh, wow, okay. We got a, a hose here. Some kind of... I guess to reach down, okay. Oh look, it comes with a cigarette lighter, a, a thingy. It's, that's the main core, so it's strictly for car. They don't have a plugger in it for it. Huh, interesting. And it comes with a couple of uh, attachments here, a little crevice tool and a little brush tool, all right. And they got some instructions here. Two-in-one car vacuum cleaner. All right, all right. So far, I'm, I'm kind of, I don't know if I like the plug. I mean, I guess it's nice because you could have one dedicated just for the car, but uh, it seems like you could get you could get an adapter for that. But because now I can't, I've got to go out to the car to test this thing really for for, for reals. So there's a button right here that pops off. Looks like a. It's where it sucks into, and there's a filter on there. Is that what that is? Yeah, that right there. Okay. Nice, uh, this good heft too. I like the, it's like a rubber around plastic is what that is. So this is, this is plastic. This is of course the filter, the paper. And then you have uh, this part right here is plastic, but then this all around here is plastic, uh, rubber. And so that gives for a greater seal whenever uh, you turn on the vacuum, whenever it's doing its suction power. So you just fit it right back into there. Okay, cool. I like that. That's obviously the sucker right there. And then that just pops right back on. Yeah. Okay, cool. I guess this is my on off switch. So it's only one speed, I'm assuming. And then these are the attachments. Okay, this one obviously goes in like that. Not very long, this crevice tool. Uh, I feel like you know, whenever you're getting in between your seat and your console, like you want to get down and, oh, I guess that's what this thing's for. Ha! <laughs> Lane, you're a genius, right? So you pop that on there and then you can, oh, actually this makes it kind of nice because now you can, you can have it at whatever level and you can actually move this wand thing around into there. That's pretty nice. I like that. I like this flexible wand here. Now, I just don't understand quite how this thing attaches. So, let's... Oh wait, that attack! Oh, okay. That's a good way to keep it all together too. So this thing, I think, attaches, yeah, to the back here. Check that out. Nice. Okay. So now you have your brush. You have your crevice tool. You have just your... Well, that just came off. <laughs> Does that screw on? This part just came off, guys. Good, okay. It's, it's just like, it pops off. It's got like these little uh, nougat things, I don't know what to call it, that are supposed to grip around the hose. And it comes off fairly easily, I have to say that. That's... Okay, well. So be, I guess you gotta make sure that you're holding this before you pull. What they should do right there is 
put some glue or something to, to make that attach better. I'm curious to know if on this end the same thing happens. So, no, it's not coming out. I don't know. I don't know why this one came out, but that one didn't. Interesting. Okay. I do like, though, I like the length of this cord. Let's check, we gotta check that. Hang on, let's check the length of this cord. This thing looks long. I'm gonna guess, what y'all's guess? Let me know down in the comments below. How long do you think this cord is? I'm gonna say six feet, no, maybe eight feet, maybe, I don't know. Wow, that's a long cord, maybe 10 feet. Jeez, whoa, hello. Stepping on the er. We got the er down there. <laughs> All right, so this is six, man, that might be 12, hang on. We got six right there. Put that down, grab right here, don't fall. That's longer than 12, what in the world? Man, they hooking it up with the length here. That's uh, another, that's 12 right there. And then yeah, that's about a third of my body. So yeah, that's a 15 foot cord, wow. That's impressive, and that's good because now what you can do is plug this into your cigarette lighter, which is usually at the front of the car, and you can get this vacuum all the way to the back, not to just the back seats, but to like the trunk area, or even outside the car if you need to vacuum something outside the car. The only main concern that I have about this thing is this little nougat keeps falling off. Can you put this thing on without that? No, you can't. Oh boy, that's no good. I, I really like the, uh, the length of that cord. Now I'm curious to know how loud this thing is. Maybe we'll have to do a, a full on review of it and, uh, and check out how loud it is and whatnot so we can get an idea of motor, idea of like collection and where everything goes, how everything works there. So if you guys wanna see that, make sure to click that subscribe button and hit the bell, that way you actually get notified of our videos. Um, if you guys want to watch more of the dad reviews, I'll put some more videos right there on the screen. I'd love it if you guys watched more of our videos. If you have a product that you want us to review here on dad reviews, let me know what it is down in the comments below and I'll see what I can get for you. Let me know what kind of vacuum you guys use in the comments below uh, for your car or your house. We also have a, a Dyson one over there that we really like. Thank you guys for watching and dad out.